H how has day two gone for you personally? Uh, it was uh, very good, especially yesterday when uh, we started as a uh, Peshmerga. As you know, we we just celebrate uh, nine villages in seven hours yesterday. So it was faster than our expecting. So we will, our uh, time uh, line was 12 hours, but uh, the Peshmerga just uh, uh, liberated nine villages in, in seven hours. And the rest, uh, today, there is uh, no any operation with Peshmerga against Daesh. But uh, only the Iraqi army, still there is an uh, operation going on from uh, Gayara to, to the north and also from Guer to, to east, Are to we west, sorry. We, we saw in that report, uh, General, uh, the problem of tunnels, also the problem of suicide bombers. What is your strategy for handling suicide attackers? Uh, it really is uh, it's the biggest uh, problem for this war, the, the tunnel and the suicide, the bomb. Uh, you know, the, the tactic of Daesh, they put IODs, bombs, TNT everywhere at the houses, uh, at the road, off roads, and especially with tactic with this tunnel. So there is, for example, one of the villages was with 11 houses, eight or houses was connecting to each other by, by tunnels. Uh, not easy war, of course, but uh, for... The so side, uh, uh, the, the airstrike will the coalition helpful, and also our anti-tank uh, muscle, especially Milan, it's helped. So they destroyed many, many of them, and uh, they, they save many life of Peshmerga, of course. Uh, this is the tactic of, of Daesh. But if, let's say, face-to-face -face or front line, uh, clean front line positions from Daesh, and never they can uh, stop when the Peshmerga is starting to push them back. But uh, the tactic of, of the suicide, so of course, they are ready to die. So this is not so easy. Uh, General Barzani's Robert Parsons here. I've got a question for you. How, how well is the cooperation going with the Iraqi army, clearly key to the whole operation? Uh, really, we have a joint operation centers with the coalition and Iraqi defense minister and ministry of Peshmerga. It's very smooth and it's very helpful. Uh, so really, so so last uh, two days, how the operation and was a first time joint operation against Daesh was very success, uh, succeed, uh, and uh, we we think it's uh, so best time now, and we have very good relation now with so, Iraqi army. So let me just follow up on that. Uh, you're saying it's the first time. Uh, does that mean you're taking your orders from Baghdad? Uh, no, really, there is a joint committee together. So. Uh, they, there is uh, the order is not coming from Baghdad to the Peshmerga, but of course there was a, a joint plan together with the coalition, with the Iraqi forces, and was the the, the first uh, huge operation together. I mean Peshmerga uh, side of uh, Iraqi army together. So it was the first time to have this uh, um, uh, operation together. General Barzani, does this bode well then for the future, given the fact that? President Barzani of Iraqi Kurdistan has called for a referendum on independence uh, of Kurdistan from Iraq. Does this mean that relations could, between Baghdad and Erbil, still be pretty good? Uh, so uh, we don't know really. This is uh, something we have to look into the future because many times happen, and especially after uh, the regime, the dictator regime Saddam. So we say it's, it's, this is the Iraqi for everybody. They will be democracy system. But unfortunately, it was not like that. So... We hope, we hope they will be like that in future after Mosul. If not, we have to go to our referendum. It's our right uh, to go to our independence. You were speaking there about after Mosul. <laughs> Obviously, it's a very important question. What happens after the city is retaken? Will the Kurdish Peshmerga be involved in the administration of Mosul? Uh, really, this is the, the biggest uh, problem in future. You know, who will govern the Mosul? Who... Uh, what will happen after Daesh? This is uh, important. It's not only uh, military wise to push Daesh back or liberate Mosul, and also the Peshmerga. I don't think so. They will participate inside the city uh, to fight inside the city. Is not in the plan till now. We don't know if something will be happening in the next uh, weeks, but uh, till now we will not participate the the fight inside the city. One final question for you: uh, the uh, foreign forces. Uh, the Americans, the uh, the French, the others, how present are they? Have you personally had contact uh, with uh, coalition forces? Uh, yes, sure, of course. We have contact every day, and especially the coordination with the airstrike is very helpful, and uh, the advisor teams on ground, uh, they are at the front line. 
uh, they helping us with the, with the drone, with the information, with the advice, and they are really helpful, and we thank them. All right, General Barzani, many thanks uh, for joining us there. Thanks.